Hello, Kevin here from TrueTrafficSecrets.com and here I am in my Twitter account and today I want to cover a couple of things. Firstly, how to find new followers in an ethical manner. Uh, not necessarily targeted followers, but when you're first starting out you need to get followers and you need to get people who will follow you and you follow them. So this is one way of doing it. Um, you go into your find people here and let that page load, it'll bring up a new page. Now what I like to do is I like to go and find people in my niche who are big hitters, gurus or whatever they call them. Um, people with big lists who won't mind me stealing a few and I'll show you how to steal them in a second. I you give my computer the uh, time to do what it's got to do. It's really slow today. I apologize for that. Today will be really, really good. It'll bring up a page in a minute. There it is. And you can see it says there, um, find people on Twitter, other networks, invite by email, or suggested users. I'm looking for M Michelle Fortin. I'm already following him, but I want to show you how to um, do this properly. So if you knew and not one in your niche, you know, you might be in fly fishing or, you know, crocheting or something that, you know, it doesn't necessarily matter. You can, as long as you know someone in your niche that does have a list that you need to steal from, this is how you do it. And you can see I'm following them already. So I'm going to go to Michelle's page. And Michelle, as you see, is a copywriter, internet market strategist, business owner, author, speaker, blah, blah, blah. He's got 5,086 followers today. Okay, and all his followers are down here. And if you click view all, it'll come up with a list of all Michelle's followers. And all you do is you begin to follow those you're not already following. So, and remember that you try and pick people who have names in your niche. People have their names or they have, like this guy's got marketing twins. And you could, you could click on that and go to where his page is. But what I do is I click follow. Okay, and you're now following him, and then I'll go down the whole list of these people looking for um, mm -hmm. people who have you know interesting sounding names or have something that you know I might like. The smoking gun, for example. Mm -hmm. uh, Netta I don't know who they, these people are, but it's one way of getting followers anyway. And you go right through the list and you find out um, all these people that have interests that mirror yours or look, you know, they look pretty. Who knows? See, Mike Fulsame is already now. Mike Fulsame, I'm already following, and you can see there you are following Mike Fulsame. So you'll see this if you're already following someone in, in the person's list, it'll show you that you're following them already. Okay, I won't do any more with that, but I want to show you how effective this can be. So I'm going to go into my Sure Webmail account now. Here is my Sure Webmail. I'm just going to move this over slightly. And you can see that these are all from Twitter. And you can't see the dates, um, but these are all very recent. And I'll move this over again and show you the dates. So you can see there that on the 22nd, I got 11 followers for doing nothing. I didn't do anything to get these people. I'd already done all the work before by doing what I'm showing you now. And the 21st is about, and what, another eight or nine there, another eight or nine or ten there, another ten here. So you can see it's really effective in getting followers. And here we are back on the Twitter. I'll just move that cursor over so you can see what's going on. Okay, so now you can see how effective this is. That's getting followers. But what about in your account, you're following, you know, 650 people and only 23 are following you. That's not the purpose of Twitter. You want people to follow you and you want to follow them. So what you do is you use another little program called Twitter Karma. And this is what it looks like when you first log in. And there's the heading for it there. I'll just move that so you can see all of it. That's about all right. Okay, so you put your Twitter ID and password in here and you hit whack. Now, this does take a cup a little bit of a time and it says this could be a long time so it might well be uh, it could take any between a minute and five so I'll pause the video while it loads and then we'll come back okay so here we are now Twitter Karma is loaded and as you can see it's a basically a, a list with their avatars or their pictures 
and it's got a couple of arrows. And what these arrows mean is if you're following them, it's in green, and if they're following you, it's in red. And it's last updated to shows all, and it's showing 640 out of 640. So if you click all, and you come down here and you go, okay, I want to find out people who are following you, okay? And what you want to do that for is to see if you're not following them, because that's where you put it up there, only followers. You're finding people are following you and you're not following them. And this is one way of saying, okay, um, I've added these to my list, do they share interests? Um, am I being rude by not following them? And should I follow them? And the easy way to do that within the same page is you can mass follow all of these people. These are people who have probably signed up to my list in the last week and I haven't followed them yet. And you can see it says last update 23 minutes ago. This one down here 15 hours ago. So these are people who have followed me in the last couple of days and I haven't returned followed. So I'll come all the way down to the bottom of this page and it says check all. So I just click that. It puts a small tick in each of these boxes. Bulk follow. Hit that. And then it says it's been submitted. So that will update over the next 30 minutes to an hour and you can do the same with the people who you are following but aren't following you and now this is where you want to be really careful here because you might use this as a strategy in your niche to follow people who are experts in a particular part of your niche or in all of your niche and others who are time wasters so what you need to do is you need to review these before you do the same mass unfollow that you've just done for the follow side now i've just michelle 14 i'm going to keep him harris fellman i'll keep him i don't know this guy he's not done anything for me and this guy hasn't uh, and this guy hasn't a miss rogue although she looks really pretty hasn't done anything either and what i would do is look for people who are big in my niche and i would keep those as just following and I would observe them as they uh, go about their business um, and watch what strategies they use and copy those strategies for my business it's really very simple so I'm going to go down through this lot now and I'm going to find all the ones I don't want to follow and while I do that I'm going to pause this video and I'll come back in a minute and we'll go over some more Okay, I've clicked all those ones I don't want to um, follow anymore because they're not following me. You'll notice Harry Schwartz is in here, or I've not ticked him, or Ping Press FM, or a few other of the bigger gurus in my niche. All the other ones I've pretty much unticked, and I've kept Michael Rasmussen um, for obvious reasons. So now you just, because all the ones you've ticked are now selected, you click bulk unfollow, and the same thing, you'll get the same message. It's been submitted click that and really that's all there is to it um i'll put the well the address will be down for this particular site will be down the bottom here but if you sit if you search in google for twitter karma you'll wind up on this site and you can sign up it takes no time at all and it'll bring all your data from um, within your twitter account and it'll plonk it right inside here and this is a really cool way and really quick way of using your time effectively to keep on top of your Twitter account. This has been Kevin from TrueTrafficSecrets.com. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this and you found it useful. Uh, and come back again and you never know, you might find something else that's useful. Have a good day now. Bye-bye.